bro. I'm not even camping. I've died so many times in this spot. Buzz by my ears twice. <laughs> Why did you do the final one? Hey guys. Hi. Alright, so this is like my third day here in London. I've been resting up this last couple of days. Uh, trying to fix my sleep schedule and stuff. And today I decided to go out and explore the city a little bit. And right now I'm heading over to the British Museum. I just got off the bus and now I'm gonna go take the underground over and go like deeper into London. So right now we're here and we're trying to take the train all the way, where did it go? Oh, there it is, Holborn. And then from here I'm gonna hop off and try and get a connecting train. While I hop on this train, hopefully this is the train that I was supposed to take. <laughs> Goldmaster's is kind of tripping right now because I told him, because they're saying one thing, right? But I headed over to the platform and everyone else is telling me like, no, 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 this is not the right train, so. I'm gonna hop on this one, so hopefully this is it. Otherwise, it's gonna be really awkward. I keep forgetting to record myself, but I'll get on and off the train, but anyway, we're here at Holborn, and I actually don't need to get another train at all. All I gotta do is now is just walk to the museum. It's starting to get pretty windy now. So this is about a seven minute walk away. I really just hope that Google Maps is actually taking me to the right location. One thing I'm kind of laughing about right now is, it's like I'm actually here, like I'm actually doing this right now, you know, like, this is just so crazy to me still. Even though I've been creating content for like about a year now, I haven't been vlogging that much, you know, but. Especially now in like a big city, like this is just so crazy to me. But it's it's fun. It's fun though. I'm not gonna cap. We're finally here. Bro, this place is absolutely huge. They have like quite a few different like artifacts all over from the world that I think they're just borrowing from other countries. <laughs> Bro, now nah, this is just crazy. Not one, we got two of them as well. One thing I do want to say is that I'm, I'm not a travel vlogger by any means. I'm a vlogger who just so happens to be traveling right now. And is going to be doing like a lot of traveling in the future. On this channel, like you're really just watching me see what I experienced and stuff. Other than that, like probably a guide or anything like that. So if you guys think you guys are going to get anything informational out of me or anything like that, like just, just stop watching the video now. This channel is just me just trying to have fun and explore new things and see cool stuff. That's about it. This is definitely a place I would want to visit. But well, the thing is, like, I heard that a lot about Egypt these days is that like the tourism over there is horrible. Like a lot of people that do want to go, it's just that people, the way uh, the local street people is just so bad, and how the people out there at the pyramids are just, just trying to scam everybody and stuff. Ooh, I don't know if I can show this next stuff. Oh no, nah, bro! I know for a fact they broke those tips off on purpose. So right now I'm in like the Greece um, exhibit or whatever, and. I'll be honest, like, I love Greek mythology and stuff. I just find it really fascinating, all with, like, Thor and Odin and all that type of stuff. The thing that got me into it was uh, God of War. After that, I just hopped on Wikipedia and started searching up all different types of stuff and just learned a lot about the culture and stuff of, like, Asian Greece. I just find it crazy how with such detail people can create these, like, sculptures and stuff and these things, I guess. I don't know, sculptures, right? Like, not only that, this was made, like, a long time ago. <laughs> I don't know how many hundreds, hundreds of years, but a very long time ago. People had the tools, I guess, to be able to do this type of stuff, which is crazy to me. So I'm kind of confused. Do people just walk around like, do people just like walk around naked back then or something? Like, do they not have enough clothes? Why are they all sculpting each other without any clothes on? <laughs> Bro, I'm not gonna cap to y'all. They hate lighting here in the museum or something because there is no lights. All right, so as I'm exiting, as I'm exiting the exhibit, I just realized that nothing that I just saw was actually about Nordic mythology. <laughs> it, was, it was all Greek. I'm so dumb. I'm on the way to Africa now. <laughs> that was really awkward. You know, be honest. Do I look like intellectual or something? Do I look smart? <laughs> nah, but I do got some pretty interesting stuff over here. All right, so before coming here, obviously, I watched a video about the museum and I learned that a lot of the stuff here is actually stolen. You know, it really is cool to see all this stuff, but like, it's sad that the museum does not want to give back the stuff to the original people. Hey, yo, what are those? 
this is one of the things that I saw in the video that they were saying was stolen. They're supposed to be like they were supposed to be some type of sort of, some sort of treaty or something where like they're supposed to give it back, but like they haven't given a single thing back. Bro, this is absolutely cool. One of the things that I definitely want to get when I get older, like a lot older, when I have a lot more money, is like, definitely like a, a very cool sword or something. I don't know why swords just completely fascinate me. Bro, this dagger looks absolutely sick. All right, well, I think I've finally seen enough of the museum now. There is one more place I want to visit that I actually was not planning on going to at all, but then I saw on the map and I saw some pictures. I'm like, oh, crap. Oh, I used to play a lot of Modern Warfare when it came out a couple years ago, The new, you know, like the new one, you know? There's this one map that I hated playing on. It was called Piccadilly, and it was based in London. I actually didn't think it was going to be a real place for some reason. I looked on the map when I got here, and it was actually there, so... That's where I'm about to go to right now, and, and I saw some pictures online to see if there was, like, any, like, Similar, it Loki kind of is. Our museum, it was cool coming here, but y'all gotta start returning some of that stuff, bro. Oh dang, I'm finally here. Yo, this is actually pretty crazy. Hey, yo. This is just like the map, bro. Like in the game, there's like a lot of construction over here. And this place right here was like a was like an arcade, bro. And there's actually an entrance to the tube, just like in the game, bro. And they even got the fountain. Bro, I'm not even camping. I've died so many times in this spot. This is a pretty popular place right here. People would want to camp at. The name of this place is actually called Piccadilly Circus. And this is like kind of basically like the equivalent of Times Square in New York City. As you guys can see, the huge advertisement board right there. It's actually pretty cool seeing how accurate this place is to the actual map. Like, this is actually some pretty spot on, spot on stuff. Oh, That's some pretty cool stuff. That's gonna be it for today's vlog. I'm super pooped right now. Like my legs hurt so much. I don't think I've walked like that in a while. I'm gonna get some night, good night's rest and hopefully in the morning we can go back over there and see if there's any other things that we can do. Yeah, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in uh, next Wednesday. Peace.